Hi brothers and sisters in Christ. Um, I wanted to talk about the dream I had concerning Santa Cruz, California. Um, so I was in UC Santa Cruz um, with my friend from middle school. Um, he was giving me the tour of the campus. He was showing me around all the buildings and stuff. So just like a normal tour of a university campus. And for some reason he started showing me a casino. Um, we entered this casino and then I, I thought it was weird. I'm like, wait, why is, why is there a casino in this area? And why is he showing me a casino uh, when we were just looking at the university buildings and this casino just like it came out of nowhere it felt random so we left the casino and an earthquake started happening and we so we started running um so basically after the earthquake half of the university was destroyed like completely destroyed the buildings were all toppled down while the other half was still standing so we were running we ran to the we ran we, we ran to a hill by the ocean remember uc santa cruz is right by the ocean it's it's like the, that's the campus and the ocean is like right there so we ran to a hill by the ocean and where this part of the university was still intact so the buildings did not fall down and and we overlooked the ocean and there was like whales and sharks they were all washed ashore for some reason and I was pointing at two whales I'm showing someone like hey look at all those giant whales they washed ashore so um, after this earthquake in my dream a tsunami did not happen but we were waiting for one and um so we wanted we, we we wanted to go back to the destroyed part of the campus because we thought an earthquake already happened in that part so um if we stay here in this good part of the campus an, an earthquake might happen here and these buildings might fall on us so we thought let's go back to the destroyed part because an earthquake already happened there so there's a very low chance that it'll happen there again so we wanted to go back to that part of the campus but we couldn't there was obstacles in my in the area i don't really it was like we were going through this um, narrow pathway so it was hard to get to that area so we're like okay we'll just stay in this um standing part of the campus where the buildings have not yet been destroyed so um i do believe this was a prophetic dream from the lord so please if you live in this area if you go to uc santa cruz if you live in the santa cruz area please turn to the lord repent of your repent of all your sins i believe this coming destruction um has to do with the casinos in the area so this earthquake might happen because of maybe because of there's like casinos in the area or something the casinos are doing wrong or there's too many gamblers I'm not sure but um, it, it wasn't just a coincidence that in my dream my friend was showing me a casino so this definitely has something to do with the casinos so please repent of all your sin sins get your neighbors family members friends strangers to if they live in this area if just please repent of all your sins pray for mercy that this giant earthquake does not ha happen in your city pray for mercy that just pray for mercy and repent of all your sins this earthquake was so huge it literally like toppled the buildings it hit and remember buildings in california they're highly engineered to withstand giant earthquakes so the fact that in my dream the earthquake toppled buildings it means a lot this means that this this is not going to be some joke earthquake like a like a 3.0 or a 4.0 earthquake if this is going to be a big earthquake so please repent of all your sins Turn to the Lord. Pray for mercy that He have mercy on your soul. Pray for mercy that He have mercy on on your city. So, just please repent. Um, I would I I do not wish for this earthquake to happen. I I do believe through this dream the Lord is warning me about the com upcoming destruction. So He's warning He He's warning me and I'm warning you. So please, please repent. You don't want this earthquake to happen. Trust me. And also in the description box of this video, I have a message that I've been um, spreading across. It, it talks about, just, just please read it. And if you're going to post it on your Facebook, if you're going to print it out and give it to someone, just please do anything you can because um, not a lot of, there's still a lot of people that need to be warned about the upcoming events regarding the rapture, regarding the tribulations and Jesus' is second coming. So please spread that message. Warn the people, warn, warn your family members, warn your friends, warn your strangers, anybody you can. Thank you and thanks for listening. Um, all glory to God because all glory belongs to Him.